This math knowledge practice test question for the ASVAB and PiCat says, what is the value of x in the figures shown below? It's referring to x right here. In order to determine the value of x, it's going to be very helpful to know the measure of this missing angle in this triangle here. And to determine the measure of this missing angle in this triangle, we can use the triangle sum theorem, which says that all the angles in a triangle add up to 180 degrees, and algebraically that looks like this. Measure of angle A plus the measure of angle B plus the measure of angle C will equal 180 degrees. What's more, I can say angle A equals 70, angle B equals 50, and angle C is this unknown measure in this uh, triangle. So let's go ahead and solve for the measure of angle C. This becomes 70 plus 50 plus the measure of angle C, which is what we're trying to determine, equals 180 degrees. 70 plus 50 is 120, so this becomes 120 plus the measure of angle C equals 180 degrees. To get the measure of angle C by itself, we're going to subtract 120 from both sides of this equation. In doing so, this says the measure of angle C equals 180 minus 120, which is 60. So we know the measure of angle C is 60 degrees. In addition to knowing that there are 180 degrees in every triangle, you also have to know that uh, the measure of angle C and X form a straight line. When two angle pairs form a straight line, they're called supplementary angles. And you have to know that supplementary angles always add up to 180 degrees. So in other words, 60 degrees plus the measure of angle X has to equal 180 degrees. Now we can determine the value of x by subtracting 60 from both sides. This says x equals 180 minus 60, which is 120. So we know x is going to be c, 120 degrees.